Hi, my cappies. It's Jamie Zebra 23. I'm going to do something different because you guys always get a really fucked up reading and I'm starting to hate it. And I'm like, every time I have to do a Capricorn, I start cringing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to shuffle right. In, well, this is what you got. This is for the bad boys and girls. You got the page of wands. You got the devil. And then you got the seven of pentacles. So I'm going to shuffle the cards right in front of you guys for my good cappies. Please, God, please, angels, please, spirit guides, for my good Capricorns, for my Capricorns that are behaving themselves for the week of September 4th, 2017. Please, God, please, angels, please, spirit guides. Be careful, baby. You're going to knock over the camera. Please, God, please, angels. Three cards. Three cards for my good Cappies. My Cappies that behave themselves that are normal people and they're not doing anything psychotic. Please, God, please, Jesus, please, angels, please, spirit guides. Something good for them. Got the magician. Something good. The five of swords. My cappies that are be whoa, something fell on the floor. Yep, it's just one. What was it? The two of cups, upright. Okay, that's this is for the good cappies. Okay. Um, all right, so this is what we got. Let's start with the bad cappies. Oh, I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. If you'd like a personal reading, um, you can check out um, my website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are $25, $50, and $75. I typically do your readings within 24 to 72 hours. I have a new feature, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have a $5 one question, one answer via email only and all sorts of stuff. So, um, Page of Wands, the Devil card. And then the seven of um, the seven of uh, pentacles. So it looks like somebody's giving somebody else a play by play about where what you're doing, where you're going, what you're doing. They're giving Capricorn a play by play. Somebody's helping a Capricorn to stalk someone, or Capricorn. This could be um, this could be you. You know that that gets word that you're, that you're being stalked. You might find out that you're being stalked. But I feel like so, somebody's trying to um, to be a go between. Somebody's trying to to throw a monkey wrench in somebody else's progress this week. Also, you guys could be hearing from a um, from a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries this week, or a fellow Capricorn this week. And it shows here that there's a Capricorn that's longing and pining from for someone. Also, there's a Capricorn out there, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, that's out there that is um, that is waiting. Either um, they didn't get paid this week, and they're hoping to get paid this week, or there's no work this week, and they're hoping for work. Um, it's The guy can see the work, but he can't touch it. So it's saying here that there, you guys will hear about work this week. Then with the Magician, the Five of Swords, and the Two of Cups, some of you are realizing that a relationship did get destroyed by voodoo. Somebody did do some spell work and try to try to break up a relationship, probably with a, a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio. Um, it could have been perpetrated by a Libra, um, a Gemini, or an Aquarius person that broke you in a water sign up, a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio. Also with the Magician here, this is somebody who's very brave and has a lot of skills. Some of you could be realizing that you... Um, that you you are powerful. That um that as far as um as far as um like your your spirituality goes, a lot of you are able to do spells. A lot of you are a are capable and are able to get the things that you want. You can accomplish it um very easily. And then not only that, with the two of cups, some of you will be getting engaged this week, or or Capricorn, you find out that somebody did get engaged this week, and you try to pay someone to do some voodoo to wreck it. Um, and then also for some of you with the five of swords here, you will be finding out about a love triangle and, um, maybe somebody was dating you and one other person, Capricorn. And then you find out that, um, that through this love triangle, the person ends up breaking up with you to get engaged to somebody else. And you're like, what the hell just happened here? How did the, how did the side chick end up getting the marriage proposal or the side guy end up, you know, proposing marriage to this one over here? It's, it's going to be a shady week. I just got to tell you guys, um, Capricorn, this is going to be a weird week. I mean, but you saw me shuffle the second round. So, I mean, you guys can't, I, I swear I'm not just picking weird cards. It just comes out. And I know you guys have the same problem with pretty much every reader. Um, I don't know what's up, you know, with Capricorn. I feel like, you know, I would typically say like it's 50%, 50, 50, 50, good, 50, bad. Um, but I, I think that it's, it's probably 90, 10. And what's unfortunate is that the 10% that are really amazing, you guys are like so amazing. Uh, cause I talked to lots of Capricorns and you guys are awesome. Um, like I said, I've got a good friend. She rescued me from the hospital when I had my kid. I mean, I love Capricorns. Like, 
yeah, th this chick is amazing. I'll forever be indebted to her. I just wanted to go home and the, the doctors were like, you just had a C-section. You can't leave the hospital right now. You got to at least wait 24 hours. I was like, I want to go home. I have another baby because I've got two kids. So I didn't want my, my big one to feel left out because I went to the hospital and had another baby. But anyway, that's for another day. But anyway, so some of you do have engagements or new relationships coming in this week with a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio. And then um, some work will be coming in this week. That's pretty much the only good things that I see here. And then, of course, you know, gaining your spirituality. Um, and then um, if you do want to hear from a, from a fire sign, a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries, that's coming too. All right, guys. Ta-ta for now.